Good morning, it's Terry. Welcome to your morning cup of inspiration. Thanks for joining me. I am so excited. Today, it's Monday morning, even as I speak, Dan and Brian are preparing to travel to Tampa, Florida to be with me for the upcoming week. So uh, we are so excited to get together again. It's been some, some months since we have. And so we expect to have a great week and we want you to be a part of it with us. Uh, we'll probably do some live morning cups of inspiration at 8.15 Eastern time as we normally post. Uh, put on your calendar Tuesday evening. We will do a live event Tuesday evening, probably 8 o'clock Eastern time. So stay in touch with the feed or go to our page and we'll try to keep you posted as to what the week holds. Uh, we plan on meeting with a media specialist and just continuing to discuss to pray, to see what God has in store for Fearless Faith in 2019. Wednesday morning, we're going to be at a local TV studio. Dan's going to be on a program sharing and promoting his book. And then uh, Brian and I are going to join in into another program and share about Fearless Faith. So we're really excited about the days ahead. We always have a great time. And uh, it's just you know, the Bible talks about a merry heart, and it's real easy to have a merry heart when those guys are around and you're surrounded by friends and you can have a good time. So think about that today. If you don't have a merry heart, I want you to evaluate that and think about why. Because the Lord can give you a merry heart. In Proverbs, the 15th chapter, let me read two verses that I ran across it says, uh, uh, where is it? I lost it. Oh, there it is in the 15th verse, 15, 15, sorry. It says, he who is of a merry heart has a continual feast. It doesn't matter what your material things are. If you have a merry heart, you're continually feasting on life and on the things of God. And then a final reminder, going back to verse 13, just a couple verses before, it says, a merry heart makes a cheerful countenance. So if you think you have a merry heart, look in the mirror, make sure your countenance is matching your merry heart. If it's not, fix it, okay? Put a smile on your face. That can change somebody's day. God bless. Thanks for joining me for that morning cup of inspiration. And we look forward to you following us this week as we uh, get together and do some live events and have a lot of fun. So God bless. See you next time.